Young people kind of have the power. Everyone wants to know what young people care about. So realizing that has been huge for me. And Tommy Gevinson would know. She started a fashion blog out of her suburban Chicago bedroom at age 11 and was hanging out at events with Vogue editor Anna Wintour before she could even get her driver's license. At first, you know, there was a lot of attention on my blog because of my age. And I understand that a lot of people had doubts or felt cynical about whether or not I was really writing it myself, if I had help from anyone, or if it was just kind of a flash in the pan. And um, I'm really thankful for everyone who kind of could put that cynicism aside and just appreciate that a young person was excited about the world and writing about the stuff that was inspiring to her. Lady Gaga said you're the future of journalism. What does that mean to you? What do you think she means by that? I think she was seizing on a moment in which my blog was becoming widely read in the fashion world, that now you can self-publish and you don't need permission to have a voice. In 2011, Gevinson launched the online magazine, Rookie. She later created several editions of a book about it. It's about all kinds of things and being a teenager. With Rookie, what are you trying to change about modern media, particularly the way that it writes about and covers young women? I want Rookie to help make space and to promote um, voices that have been historically marginalized and to let readers who identify with those voices know that they're not alone and that they should have some, they should write too and they should send it to us. I am pleased to see that the ability for more and more people to have a voice online has made for feminism that's more intersectional than the movement has been historically. But adults have a place in Rookie too. You guys know how scared teenage boys are? How do I make him mine? He is deaf's my type. The most important person in the world is you. It's you and you hardly even know you. I am here uh, to do Ask a Grown Man for Rookie. The site's Ask a Grown Man series is an internet age advice column where Hollywood stars answer questions submitted by readers. Some of them are just really goofy and then some, they take it so seriously and they're so earnest. I think my favorite, um, well, John Hamm was one of the first ones and he kind of did it like Don Draper <laughs> and that was very enjoyable. I'm 41 years old. Doesn't mean you have to pay attention to me, but it's, you know, probably in your best interest. Is there a grown man, grown woman you haven't been able to get yet that you're hoping to get for the series? Oh, um, Barack Obama would be cool. And if 19-year-old Gevinson can't land the president, she's got a pretty impressive backup list. In addition to the blog, in addition to the fashion magazine, you've given a TED Talk, uh, you've starred on Broadway last year, you guest starred on Scream Queens this fall. What is there left to do? What else is on your list? Um, I'm doing another play next year. Uh, I'm doing The Crucible on Broadway. I'll be playing Mary Warren and I'm really, really excited. And I just want to keep trying lots of things and be in a position where uh, I have the, the freedom and time to do whatever I want.